Hi Aquarius, welcome to your love reading. How are you doing? I hope everything is fine for you. And let's start with your reading. First, let's shuffle the deck four times. I will try to get as many details as possible, but keep in mind that this is a general reading, so this may or may not resonate with all of you. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Now, let's continue. Let's start with what are the current energies. I see disappointment here. Possibly some rejection happened in the past. Either it was a direct or indirect rejection. Or you have this feeling like there's a loss of interest and things are not moving anywhere, not going anywhere. What is affecting you in your subconscious at this moment of time? You're trying to find that balance, that inner contentment and happiness back into your life. You're starting to prioritize yourself and becoming more aware that if you put much focus and credit to something that is not helping you at all maybe that is something that should be reconsidered and not should put so much expectations upon what was the main challenge in the past there were so many differences there between you both i think that it was very difficult to reconcile those differences at the same time, somebody may have become very impatient and wanted quick results without doing that heavy work that was needed to move this to that next important level. I have Leo, I have Sagittarius, Water and Earth as well. How do you view this situation? You still feel confused. Some of you think that you should be keeping your options open. You're wasting your time. Some of you don't want to wait anymore on this person and want to find a new, better partner. And that is your focus. Your wish is to be happy and independent in a loving relationship. But you want that inner contentment, that balance, that harmony. All those cups that are real cups filled with love and emotions. And you don't want this to be an illusion. You hope for a new passionate beginning happening as soon as possible. And what you fear the most is some insecurities that you have around the idea that what if the next connection will be unreliable, inconsistent? What if they will come towards you with lots of desire and then they turn this off immediately? That is one of your fears. Now let's see, what is the advice for you? What is the advice you need to hear right now, Knight of Wands? Things will be changing fast, especially if you feel stuck here. Uh, communication will be happening. There's a person watching you and they want to talk. There's lots of attraction. There's lots of desire. There's a person here thinking a lot about you. I'm not quite sure if this is a past person or a new person, but keep this in mind. Things will be changing soon. Somebody wants to talk. Maybe a new or past person. Now let's see what may happen. If you and your ex reconnect, let's see, what is the possible outcome? What is the energy? Uh, why the tower? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. As you can see, with the tower, five of pentacles, page of wands, reverse, eight of swords. If you are feeling confused, nothing may change much. It needs extra work from both of you it does not uh, it, it isn't easy as a restart if it happens there needs to be lots of work done by both of the partners there's a lack of maturity 
there's a lack of love there as well. <clears throat> something is broken heavily by that tower moment. Unfortunately, something has been cracked deeply. And yes, there's a possibility of a, a comeback. Somebody wants to return or is thinking a lot about going back. But to tell the truth, as always, and to give the clarity that you may need if this reading is resonating with you, I think that you will still feel confused here or may soon not find that uh, solution to this complex situation, especially if you want to repeat it and want to try again and make it better. So it's a bit complex, but I want to view more details, in fact, about this person that is on your mind about their feelings. Let's see, do they have feelings? What kind of feelings do they have? How do they view you? What are their intentions for now? What are their energies? What are your energies as well? What are the energies that are the same for both of you? So I will continue this reading with more details if you are interested in the extended video that is in the description box below this video or at the side of this video. Thank you for watching. I hope this was helpful. See you the next reading and bye for now.